Hey guys, it's me Hayden. Welcome back to my channel. I'm so excited today because we are gonna be reacting to yet again, another TLC show. And if you know me, which you don't, you would know that I love me a TLC show. Today, we are gonna be reacting to My Strange Addiction and specifically the episode, I am attracted to older women, much older women. My Strange Addiction. This is gonna be a cinematic masterpiece. It's gonna be a period piece. It's gonna be a work of art. Although now that I'm thinking about it, much older women. It's probably gonna be a lack of period piece. A post-menstrual piece, if you will. Anyways, let's go ahead and get into this video because I'm tired of talking to your rancid motherfucking bitch ass. <laughs> My name's Kyle, I'm 31, and I'm addicted to dating older women. So our addict is named Kyle. He's 31 and he's addicted to dating older women. Cougars, if you will. Grandmamas, sugar mamas, etc. Much older women, like 60, 70, 80 year old. Older women. Like 80 year olds. Okay. I don't want to be like judgmental, you know, as long as it's consenting adults, there's nothing wrong with it. But like, what is it about an 80 year old woman that is more attractive to you than someone your own age? I want to know what it is about these older women that you like. Do you just like them for their like mental maturity, being older women, or are you like a wrinkled cooter addict? I love everything about older women. I love the smell. I love the feel. I love the mentality. That woman's face doesn't look real, right? Like, am I crazy? Or does that woman's face look like it was like photoshopped on? I love dentures. Well, I guess that answers my question. What do you like about older women? I love dentures. I'm a little scared that it's not dentures that he likes, but it's the fact that dentures can be removed, if you know what I'm saying. Women, you know, they can be self-conscious about dentures. Ladies, I promise you, telling your man that you have dentures will not turn him off. It'll put a smile on his face. It'll put a smile on his pants. No. I don't want to know how dentures affect your pants. No. No. Mm -mm. He dated a 91-year-old. This man is a nursing home predator. I'm on my state website right now, and there's a lady on here named Karen. She absolutely has a look that I'm attracted to. She has the platinum hair, has a great smile. She looks very pretty, very adventurous. He's into an old elderly woman named Karen. This is so weird. I'm so uncomfortable. I don't even know what to say. I just feel uncomfortable. There's a lot of terms for sexy older women. There's MILF, saber tooth tiger, cougar. My favorite term, I'll probably say it would be silver fox because the silver fox relates back to the platinum hair. That's what really turns me on. So I just sent an email to Karen. The first time I realized I was the trek to old women was in sixth grade. There was a really, really sexy teacher, and she was probably about 65. Aren't you like 12 in sixth grade, and he was fawning over his 65-year-old teacher? Like, I don't want to kink shame or like shame anyone for what they're attracted to, but to me, this is screaming like some kind of like drama. I'm sorry. She had the platinum hair. She was top heavy. And she was just gorgeous. I know he meant that as a compliment, but if someone ever described me as top heavy, I would be so offended. I can't imagine top heavy ever being perceived as a compliment by anyone, even if you just mean they have giant boobs. Like the term top heavy just sounds like a slap on the face. Sounds like you're referring to a truck, a motor vehicle, if you will. And I don't generally enjoy being compared to two ton hunks of metal, but that is just me. Sex with older women. Truth is, they like it. A 68 year old woman enjoys passionate, vigorous sex just as much as a 23 year old college cheerleader. College cheerleader. The mental images that are being forced upon me by this video 
are horrifying. I don't want to think about this man having passionate intercourse with anyone, especially not a 91 year old toothless woman. So he's getting set up on a date with a woman who's actually like, you know, somewhere near his age within 10 years, hopefully. So let's see how that goes. See if he's into this uh, non pruned up cooter hole. What the fuck did I just say? Oh my God. When I'm my age, it's not that I can't recognize that they're attractive. I mean, because they are, of course. I guess the way I look at it is they're just, they're not ripe yet. They're not ripe yet. When I think of ripe, I think of things getting like more squishy and more um, flavorful. Ugh. What is this? Hi, hey. Mr. Kyle. I'm Kyle, how are you today? I'm Candace. My first impression of Candace, she was cute as could be. I bet her grandma is gorgeous. How dare you? In his head, he's just like, you know, this girl would be really fucking hot if she was 50 years older, was missing a few teeth, super wrinkly, her vagina was a lot looser, and her body was falling apart. Oh, so hot. What is a normal date for you like? Normally, she's um, between 60 and 80. 16, 80. Well, we have drinks. What's the look? Are you serious? It's like my grandma's age. What's your name? Like my grandma. What's your name? What's your grandma? No. He's trying to get his date to hook him up with her grandma. I mean, at least be discreet about it. I mean, you're just trying to get her grandma's coochie right in front of her. That is weird. That's not right. That's rude. Candace is someone that, like, I would definitely hang out with her just having fun. But she's not old enough for me. Why do you like women that are so visual? I mean, yeah, I like my hands. Like it when their veins bulge. It makes me bulge, too. Um, I like white hair. I call it platinum hair, actually. I like neckline. You like the gobble gobble? <laughs> no, no. In 30 years, I'll take you a lot more seriously. <laughs> hey, tell your grandma I said hi. <laughs> I feel so bad for this girl. Imagine going on a date with some guy and you sit down with them and you're like, so like, am I your type? And he's like, I mean, you're okay, but like, You'd be a lot hotter if you were a old lady with no teeth and a loose vagina. Who would want to hear that? I met this lady online named Karen. I saw her pictures. I thought she was absolutely gorgeous. Oh God, we're back to Karen. I don't know what to say. She doesn't look so great to me personally. Not my type, I guess. And I am so looking forward to meeting her tonight. Karen, <laughs> so good to finally meet you. <laughs> oh my God, he said, Karen, you look good, girl. Uh, Ew. Karen looks like her kids have gone through menopause. I don't think she's gonna wanna get down and dirty with you, to be honest. Look at her, she'll break. Her hair looks so brittle. It's a little bit nerve wracking because, well, he is so much younger than I am. Um, based on how yellow her teeth are, I think they're real. And I'm not thinking that he's gonna like that. Although they do look pretty brittle, so you could probably just pop them out. I've got butterflies in my tummy. That hasn't happened in so long. Why is she acting like a 13 year old girl? <laughs> He's so handsome. Oh, I have butterflies in my tummy. Karen, you're a hundred years old. Your children could be his parents. Such a gent. Thank you very much. Oh, you. <laughs> so Karen showed up for dinner tonight. She looks sexy as hell. She looks sexy as hell. She looks a hundred. This is making me so uncomfortable. I, mean, I thought, wow, when I saw her. It's so great to finally meet you. Did you see her face? It was like... She is so horny. I, I stand corrected. She wants to get dicked the fuck down. She wants her granny prune pussy torn the fuck up. She said, I may be post-menopausal, but I want you to pound my pussy till it's bleeding like I'm 25. Oh my god, what is wrong with you? I'm so sorry. You I looked know. great online, but you look incredible in person. You really do. Oh, that's so sweet of you to say that. Why did you respond? 
Girl, those bags under her eye could not only hold my car keys, but they could hold my entire fucking car. I look at like all of these celebrity women that are going out with younger men, and I thought, well, you know, maybe I should try it. I'm not going to say that I necessarily decided to come out with you because of your mind. <laughs> she said, I mean, you seem like an intelligent young man, but I'm really just here to get dick to the fuck down. You can help with that, right? And he very much seems into it. Let's call a spade a spade. He wants the ushy gushy granny pussy. It's fun to be able to feel like this again, you know? Just all excited and quivering. And... I'm never eating a mozzarella stick again. Those brown teeth scraping against that cheap mozzarella stick. All excited and quivering and thinking, oh, I wonder what's going to happen next. She's all excited and quivering. <laughs> this woman's like 90 years old. I'm old enough to be your mother, definitely. Maybe yeah, old enough to be your grandmother, but you're depending. Pretty, but you're pretty enough to take home, though. <laughs> So, they ended up going back to his place together. I am really, 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 really scared to see what they end up doing. Like, really scared. <sighs> the date with Karen was incredible. She was 100% my type. I had a wonderful time with Kyle. Oh my God. He is sucking that geriatric tongue right out of her face. And I've had such an amazing time. I just don't want it to end. She is holding those juices in. That dry ass pussy is wet for the first time in years. Look how horny she is. Look at her face. My name is Jackie. I came to visit Kyle from Florida. I'm kind of hoping that he'll come back with me. So now we're meeting Jackie, who was Kyle's ex-girlfriend, whom apparently he cheated a lot on all the time. He just fucked around with all the cougars in town. Pounded his way through every fucking nursing home in the state. She's back to win her man back. Steal him back away from that other old ass Karen bitch. Fuck a bitch named Karen. He wants this geriatric, ushy, gushy, wet and mushy old lady pussy. This show is turning me into a monster. I don't even recognize myself in the viewfinder anymore. I don't know who that is. He's so hot, but he's unrecognizable. Babe, you made it. Hey, sweetie, how are you? Good, 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 you made it. Kyle and I, you know, we date on and off, but I'm really not his type. Because I'm too young for it. Yeah, I'm only 61. You know she hella got off on saying that. She was like, uh, I'm just a little too young for his type. I'm a fresh little, little spring chick. Uh, uh, uh. That's not a chick sound. That's her sound. That's the sound she makes. She's too young for him, but all of her kids are older than him. That is not okay. <laughs> Why do I have to see this man making out with so many old ladies? Like, just tell me about it. I don't need to see it, okay? We had so much fun, we really did. Yeah, we did have a good time. Just seemed to get along so well. Even when I was dating whoever and you were dating whoever, we seemed to always come home to each other. So they were both cheating on their partners with each other. What? What is going on? What is happening? Mm, bro. I think you should think about coming back. I have to make a decision. I'm either gonna stay in Pittsburgh or I'm going back to Florida. Be with Jackie. What about all the other women that you were chasing? All your old beautiful women. Karen was 100% my type. I would definitely date her. Uh, <laughs> why? Like, one time, okay, prove to us he really makes out with old ladies, I get it. But do I have to see him make out with every single old lady on the show multiple times? I can't take it. Should that not work out? Florida is a hotbed of sexy ass grandmas. That was the worst thing I've had to react to yet. 
period. I would have rather watched the lady make out with her rats again. That was way less disgusting than this. There are no words to describe how I feel right now. None. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please leave a like, a comment, a share, a subscribe, etc. You gotta do all of them, every single one. You just have to. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.